And we want to bring back our NBC Force Tony Shin, who is in Marietta. And Tony, you felt this. It woke you up while you were sleeping, right? It really did. You know, I had just woken up and I was kind of in that zone where you're going back and forth. Turn on the TV, I was watching you guys, and uh, that's when it happened. And like I said before, my son immediately, he's six years old, he's in bed. Uh, with me, and uh, he immediately woke up and looked at me, uh, you know, befuddled, like, what was that? I think that was uh, technically the first. Um, and I'm sure he's going to remember it because it was pretty shocking to him. I do want to point out one thing. I, I believe just about a week ago, we had about a 4.3, 4.4 earthquake in the DeVore area because I remember I was out there covering it uh, with my photographer. I uh, was covering a different story when it happened, and we uh, provided some live coverage. I wonder if this is somehow uh, a big aftershock from that, because all those fault lines kind of go through that uh, Cajon Pass area, and that, I believe, is connected to that Beaumont uh, Banning uh, Valley as you head out towards the Palm Springs area. And yeah, we were talking about that earthquake, too. I remember when that happened, social media just blew up. A lot of people mm -hmm. felt that one as well.